quick Blender tutorials with Rustum. So let's say you're having a dandy old time in Blender and you make yourself a cool hallway. But when you flip the TV channel to render mode, it's quite dark. <laughs> <clears throat> Your first thought would be to place lights individually, which works, but it probably sucks big time trying to place each individual light. And doing overheads with a miss of materials works, but it also might be a bit draining on some devices, and sometimes might not even produce a result you're happy with. So, here's what you can do low key. First things first, since we're working on lighting, you'll want to move your camera to the interior. This is pretty obvious. <clears throat> Uh, yeah. Next, you're gonna get a plane by pressing Shift A, going into Mesh, and then Plane. This plane doesn't need to be seen by the viewer, so you can just go to the Materials tab, add a new material, and change the surface to a TRANSPARENT BSDF! That way, whenever you go to the Material Preview, it's invisible. Ooh, Next, move your plane up to your first light. Make sure it's center. Bam! I got mine. Then, with the plane selected, go to the Modifiers tab, click Add Modifier, go to Generate, and then select Array. Change the offset of yours. I have mine set up already, and you can change the count to make it so that it matches the amount of lights that you want or have. Next, we're going to actually add the lights. Press Shift-A, go to Light, and then select any light you want. I wouldn't choose sun though, because those tend to be pretty bright. <laughs> you see, the joke is, it's a sun, and suns tend to be bright. You see, because... Laugh! LAUGH! PLEASE! LAUGH! Next, move your light up to the first plane. Uh, I'm also gonna scale mine. Perfection. You can see that once they're perfectly lined up, for the most part, it's good. Uh, they're not perfectly lined up. Okay, next you're gonna select the light. Then you're gonna select the plane. You're gonna wanna parent the light to the plane by pressing Control p and pressing Object. Now the plane has the light attached to it. Now, you're gonna wanna select the plane. You're gonna go to Object Properties tab. And then you're gonna go to Instancing. Select Faces. So you can see now, that with how many planes there are, there are also many lights. And now, you can go to rendered mode and select the- what? And select the first light and change whatever values you want. I'm gonna turn up the exposure though for mine. 